Hi, this is Chris and I'd like to introduce the Collatz patch I wrote for Pepper. It's based on the Collatz conjecture, also known as the 3n plus 1 problem. Collatz conjecture is a very simple mathematical idea where you take a number and when it's odd you triple it and add 1 and when it's even you divide by 2 and you keep doing this until you eventually will reach 1. And this will, depending on your initial input value, generate semi-random strings of numbers, which is what we are interested in here. The input will be on the first jack or the first pot. The output numbers are mapped logarithmically to the first output jack. What you do is you sample the input value using this left button here or sending a trigger to uh, input 6 and then you step through the number sequence using the right button or input 7. So let's just see that in action. Nice. The second mode will resample the input automatically when the sequence reaches one. So we'll see a little light blink when we change modes. There we go. Sample it, step through it. That means you can generate um, repeating patterns but if you run a noise source in the input, for example, the results will be more variable. There's a third mode where the end of the ramp time will clock the sequence. Uh, so we turn up the ramp time a little and give it an input value. First clock, and off she goes. Okay, that's mode number three. Mode number four does the same thing, but will also resample the input value when it reaches 1. In parallel to the main output, the number string gets remapped to 7-bit binary present on jacks 1 to 7. Let me demonstrate that. Um, just sample a number. And we will see the binary outputs being activated. Now the binary outputs also have a mode knob, which is the fourth one here. Um, and in the first mode that we're in now, um, these outputs are also subject to the slew.
This is also subject to the same clock mode, so you could have it resample, restart. The binary outputs also have a mode knob, which is this one. The first mode you've already seen is um, basically slowed outputs. Second mode, there we go, flashing light, um, keeps the binaries just straight ones and zeros gates. There we go, where the main output is slewed. And then uh, third mode is this one, is uh, triggers.